Happy Project for Awesome! The charity that I've chosen to talk about this year for Project for Awesome is a group called Invisible Children. I met Innocent in 2010 when he came to the United States to share his experience about being a night commuter in Uganda. For over 25 years, the Lord's Resistance Army, led by Joseph Coney, has abducted children from their homes and forced them to fight as child soldiers. Invisible Children was created by three guys who went to Africa with a video camera, and what they found were these child soldiers and night commuters who were forced to give up almost everything just to survive. These child soldiers are often forced to kill their families and each other, and if they don't, they are killed. Invisible Children's goal is to help free the child soldiers and end the 25-year conflict that has been happening in Central Africa. Invisible Children over the last year has set up an LRA crisis tra tracker, which is this website, and you can go to it to see uh, information about attacks that are happening. Um, or that have happened and uh, if anybody was hurt or killed or abducted. And it's really, it's actually really cool. Um, recently, Invisible Children just actually this week finished their frontline tour, which was to raise $2 million to help continue funding their protection plan. And what that protection plan, well, what that $2 million is going towards is creating radio towers so that uh, People can be made aware of the attacks that are happening nearby and have time to get to safety. In that part of Africa, there's literally nothing, and these radio towers are actually saving people's lives. Now, I first heard of Invisible Children in 2008 when I saw the documentary The Rough Cut. And it touched me, um, and I highly encourage anybody who is interested in human rights to watch this this video. Since then, Invisible Children has made multiple documentaries about um, children that were child soldiers or night commuters. Uh, innocence is included. So what can you do to help Invisible Children? Well, for starters, you can host a screening and get involved. If you go to the website www.invisiblechildren.com, which I will put at the end of this video, you can find other ways to help get involved and you can help donate uh, to fund the protection plan. That is literally saving people's lives.